Hey y'all, happy new moon. So today I'm going to teach you how to make a gold opener jar. So you're going to need seven bay leaves. So over here I'm showing you seven bay leaves. So try to get the best looking bay leaves. If you can find non-dry bay leaves will be best, but dry bay leaves is fine, but try to find the best one. You're going to need brown parchment paper to write your name with some blue pen. So you're going to write your name and date of birth in the brown parchment paper. And you will be needing some black pepper. You can use white pepper or any other mixed pepper, but you need black pepper and you need a glass jar and then also just cleanse your cleanse the area. So now you're going to write your name and your date of birth. So try to rip the paper so you can add your energy to it. So just make a small circle. So this girl actually learned it from a fellow uh, spellcaster. And what you're going to do here is you're going to rub the paper so you can add your energy to the paper, right? And if you're doing it for a client, obviously, you wouldn't have to do this step. So now you're going to write your name on the paper. Now you're going to use a black marker and you're going to write, write seven wishes on the bay leaves. Each bay leaf for one wish of what you want to remove blockages from. So for example, money, you can write remove blockages for money or just money on the paper and then you'll take the next one or the leaf and you'll just write your seven wishes on there and just continue on until you're done with all seven bay leaves so just put exactly what you want in there and then when we're done we're going to move forward to the next step so this is me just writing my wishes onto the bay leaf right now and it's kind of fast forward because I don't want you to have to sit through this whole thing and just to see what I'm writing. So we're done. Now we're going to get the jar and you're going to place your name paper inside the jar like so. So you put your name and your date of birth. You put your first, middle, and last name and your date of birth, of course. And you're going to put each and every single bay leaf inside the jar exactly what you wrote in there. You can say it out loud while you put it in there because you want to set your intention and put your intention in the jar. So just go ahead and put all your bay leaves in there one by one. Take your time. There's no rush. I made the video nice and short for everyone to be able to do this for a new moon so you can open your world to whatever you want to open your world to. And you can do this every single month or every single week as long as you want to do whenever you feel like doing it just for So once you are done placing all the bay leaves and also your name paper, you're going to get some really, really hot boiling water and pour it inside like you're making a tea, a perfectly hot tea, right? So be very careful when you're pouring because it can splash. Now you're going to put pepper, just add pepper until you no longer want to add anymore. Just keep putting. You see, I was very, very aggressive with the pepper. I bought it especially for this. And whatever is left over, I will do another wood opener a few days or a month later. But just go ahead and add as much pepper as you want. Just go until you feel like you should stop, right? And then just speak your intention without you putting it. Like letting the mixture know what the jar, what the um, black pepper is to do. So you just keep continuing to put, you see how I just kept going and look at it like you can see how the peppers are just moving and it smells so good. Everything is mixing up together right now to make the perfect mixture. So now you're going to take five minutes, set your timer for five minutes, you're going to sit there. Now the jar will be very, very hot to you, be very careful not to burn yourself. But sit for five minutes and speak your intention and in exactly what you want. What you wrote on those bay leaves, you're going to speak it out loud into the jar so you can basically manifest what you want, right? So you're going to just sit with your jar and you're going to speak your intention. And once you are done, what you will do is you're going to take the jar and put it in the highest uh, shelf that you have in your house for seven days. You will not touch it. You will leave it there for seven days and seven nights. And you just leave it there just to do its thing and after seven days you're going to go and find a nice bushy area with trees and whatever and you're going to take your jar of the mixture and you're going to toss it out you can throw the whole jar away or you just toss it out 
and just walk away and not look back. You see all the steam that's coming out of it? It's perfect. So it's well steamy. It's ready. So yeah, you will set it up in a high shelf somewhere in your house, in the kitchen, in the refrigerator, anywhere. That's, that's the information that I got. And yeah, so you're going to let it sit for seven days and seven nights. And once you're done, you will find a nice bush somewhere or a anywhere where there's a nice established plant or tree and you're going to just toss it out and you will walk away and not look back and believe me i have tried it it works i love it it's super easy to do it doesn't require any candles and it also does not require too much work so sit with your um, jar for about five minutes so you can go ahead and manifest and speak to the jar and set your intentions. So here is a look at what the jar kind of look like really when you're done. It's nice and brown because of the black pepper. And now by the seven days going to get a little bit darker because all of the juice from the bay leaf is going to also go in the water so i hope you guys enjoy this little short video let me know if you want more but this definitely worked and you can do it as many times as you want and there's no particular day for you to do it there's no particular moon phase for you to do it just do it whenever you feel like you should just sit and right now what i'm doing is i'm sitting and i'm talking and i'm speaking to my jar just set my intention and just look at the pepper look at what it's doing it's just beautiful i love it i love doing this work let me know if you guys want more videos